Hi, today we're going to talk about reconditioning 12V battery. All over the world, millions of batteries are thrown away when they are no longer usable. This includes batteries used in cars, golf carts, motorcycles, heavy equipment and many other battery types used for many other applications. The reason for most batteries becoming useless is from a process called sulfation, which is actually a build-up of deposits on the lead plates in the battery. As the build-up progresses the battery loses its ability to take and hold a charge till it reaches the point it is considered dead. What happens when you recondition a battery as you are removing the deposits on the lead plates? One way of doing this is to add an additive to the battery which in turn helps remove the deposits. You may ask why recondition the battery when you can hook up a battery recharger. The recharger only charges the battery to the capacity the battery will allow under its current state. Charging the battery does not remove the deposits from the sulfation process. After reconditioning the battery you can recharge back to its full capacity again. There are a few ways they can be reconditioned and some people do this with the tools they already have at home. There are other tools that can be purchased to make the process even more streamlined. Many have made it a profession and made a successful business of reconditioning batteries. Some specialized tools are recharger-like devices that are designed for reconditioning them. Another technique is to precondition a battery in a refrigerator before reconditioning with a tool like this. It may help ease the breaking up of the deposits. You can even recondition nickel-cadmium batteries such as used in household devices. A common method is to cycle them by fully charging then fully discharging completely three times. This can bring them back up to their full capacity in many cases. Remember to check your car battery occasionally to make sure it is in good condition. Also car batteries need care when handling, be very careful with all aspects of handling them for your safety. When working on them be sure to wear protective gear. If you can recycle batteries by reconditioning them you would be saving yourself money by keeping your batteries in use much longer. You will also be helping the environment by reducing the amount of waste in the form of batteries from going to the landfills. If you want to, to learn more about reconditioning batteries and its benefit to you check out the link below in the description. Take a look for more information. Thanks for watching, have a nice day.